Hey guys, don't worry, I'm here to help you to fix this problem with the step by step perfect solution. So let's begin. Click on advanced options, then we need to select troubleshoot, then select advanced options and then click on command prompt. Type chkdsk slash f slash r c colon and hit enter to execute the command now wait for some time to complete the process once done move to the next step type c colon and hit enter to execute the command type cd space c colon slash and hit enter to execute the command type cd space windows and simply hit enter to execute the command now type cd system32 and hit enter now execute this command type cd space config and simply hit enter then type md space backup and hit enter now execute this command type copy space star dot star space backup and simply hit enter now execute this command type md space backup one then hit enter now type copy star dot star backup one and simply hit enter to execute the command type in cd space reach back then simply hit enter then type dir and simply hit enter now type copy space star dot star space dot dot and hit enter then type all and hit enter to execute the command type in boot rec space slash fix mbr and hit enter to execute the command type bootrec space slash fix boot and hit enter now type in cd space c colon slash and simply hit enter to execute the command now type cd space windows slash system32 slash config slash reach back and hit enter to execute now type this command bcd edit space slash exports space c colon slash bcd backup then hit enter type cd space c colon slash and hit enter now type this command md space boot and simply hit enter now type cd space boot and simply hit enter now execute this command type md space bcd now execute this command type cd space c colon slash and hit enter now type attrib c colon slash boot slash bcd dash h dash r dash s and hit enter type in ren c colon backslash boot backslash bcd bcd dot old and simply hit enter to execute this command type bootrec space slash rebuild bcd and hit enter type exit and hit enter now click on continue it will restart your system so that's it guys your problem is solved and you are good to go